Hello YouTubers, my name is Freddy from Virality Gaming and today I'm bringing you a tutorial. Yes, it's Friday, which means we're going to be doing a tutorial, but it's different. Uh, we're not doing Premiere Pro CC today, we're actually going to be doing a bit of audio editing. Uh, how do I make it so then my games or my videos, I mean, uh, have low static? And yes, I am going to say this up straight to you guys, most mics come with static. Um, that's just a fact. Uh, if you're lucky, you'll get a mic without a static, and, uh, but I was not. I got a mic that came with static. The reason why they have static is so that it can pick up um, your voice better, and it kind of picks up too much, and it picks up static, which we don't want. And um, so, how are we going to get rid of the static? Well, right here I have a test clip that I will be going through. You'll also see this massive section right here. Uh, why is it blank? Well, the reason why it's blank is because we want the static by itself. Uh, it will allow us to just edit out the static. If you had any more, it, you will be taking too large of a wavelength from all of the uh, audio, which will make your voice sound muffled. So I'll explain a bit more of this five seconds of silence afterwards, but let's get started with the test clip. Hey guys, Fred here. Here is the test clip that I've been talking about. We're just going to get right into it and uh, do the five seconds of silence. And that will be starting right now. There we go, the five seconds of silence. I've already explained why we're doing the five seconds of silence, but I'm just going to recap. It is to allow us to uh, only get the static by itself. And I'll be showing you why that will come in handy. Anyway, continue watching to continue learning. Okay, so as you can tell, we just did a test clip there, including the five seconds of silence. And I'm just going to do a recap of what that meant. Um, the five seconds of silence takes away all of your voice and vocal sounds and stuff like that, just leaving the static. Let's get straight into it. Um, so what you want to do is left click and highlight the five seconds of silence or four seconds or whatever you have. Um, make sure there isn't any little bumps, like my line is pretty straight, uh, which is good. If you have a lot of static, your line will be bumpy, the wavelengths will be bumpy, um, which is fine if it's a normal thing. But if there's like a little bump out of the random, kind of like this one right there, um, then try and just like, I don't know, highlight everything else but that little bump that could possibly be there. I don't have a really good example. I guess right here is a little bump that could be a good example. Um, but anyway, so get a pretty decent smooth line or just try and get the static only by itself. And then what we're going to do, once you've highlighted it, is go to effects, go to noise removal, and then we're going to hit get noise profile. Once we do that, we're going to hit Control A, and that will highlight everything. Now that it's got the noise profile that it wants, uh, what the noise profile is, is it's, um, it's that little section that it will be removing from all of this. Uh, okay, and so we're going to go back to effects, we're going to go back to noise removal, and we're going to hit OK. And what this will do is it may take some time if you have a longer footage, but because mine, uh, longer audio I mean, but because mine is really short, it took no time at all. Now, if we're going to listen again, you should hear it without any static. Hey guys, Fred here. Here is the test clip that I've been talking about. We're just going to get right into it and uh, do the five seconds of silence. And that will be starting right now. There we go, the five seconds of silence. I've already explained why we're doing the five seconds of silence, but I'm just going to recap. It is to allow us to uh, only get the static by itself, and I'll be showing you why that will come in handy. Anyway, continue watching to continue learning. So as you can tell, we did the five seconds of silence, um, and it gave us that section that we wanted to get rid of all the static. You may still hear slight static when I'm talking, but it isn't as bad as the first one. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope it helped you out. 
Uh, it's just another step to make your videos better, I would recommend it. Audacity is a great software to uh, help you out. You have a bunch of effects up here uh, that you can use. I personally only use noise removal because that's all I need. But to create the best audio you want, you can fiddle around with them and uh, improve uh, your audio in general. Anyway, once again, I hope you guys enjoyed. If this helped you, hit the like button. Leave me a comment on uh, any suggestions of the uh, next tutorials you want me to do. And uh, subscribe if you haven't already. Once again, thank you and talk to you soon. Peace. Okay, we've got the weapon secured and let's uh, secure the body. Oh my god, I have a pointy ass. <laughs> Holy shit!